Eve. Today we're going shopping. First stop, 7 Eleven. What? I know it's really quick because it's a quick stop, so. A copy. Fake Gatorade? Oh, sport Aid. Yeah, it's not quick. I prefer one of those. Sponsor, yeah. Maybe I'll try this one. We're getting electrolyte drinks. <laughs> Quick and easy. You know, sometimes you just need electrolytes. Okay, we're trying the first one. It's called Sponsor, is the brand. And it has its own theme song. Ah, oh, Dan, how are you doing? Oh, I've been I trying really to. Like it. Yeah, well, really I've been trying to reach in. I, I think my phone must be an old number or something. Okay, good, good. You know, when you go to foreign countries sometimes, especially foreign countries with uh, very unique bacteria, that's not necessarily bad for you, but just different. That your body is probably not used to. Uh, sometimes things happen to your body and they make you want to have more electrolytes afterward. Um, I'm not saying it happens to people who are as fancy as I am with all my makeup on and my fanciness today, but you know, they, it's important that I let everyone know that that could happen to you. <laughs> uh, so decode it yourself! Google it! Okay, back to shopping. <laughs> Time for lunch! Hey, what are you going to do? Go back. 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 Go It's pork on rice with like a sauce and it just melts and it is just... Pork leg. Pork leg. Pork leg. Chinese style. Oh, it's Chinese. Well, there you go. It's a Chinese style thing. And it's amazing. What is it called? Cow kamu. It's called cow kamu. Cow means rice and kamu means pork leg. And that's, that's that. So this is called Gutio, which is actually, once again, from China. Gutio. Is this one really popular? Huh? Is it really popular? Very popular. Because I hear every that day. word all the time. Almost everyone has uh, noodle soup every day. Gutio. Okay, Gutio. And Gutio is just like a type of noodle soup. Noodle soup. Okay. And then the stuff you put in it, is that specific or is that, like that's on top of it that's being Gutio? Uh -huh. Okay. And what do you have in yours? Shrimp balls. Shrimp balls. Uh -huh. There you go, there you have it. Oh my goodness, I just can't. It is so close delicious. To the oh. reception desk. Mm. And it was 130 baht total for the whole meal, including our drinks. Which translates to about four dollars. There you go. And that's why it's good. Oh, we're at the mall now, and this is always a fun time. <laughs> it's a cold, cold forest. Oh my god, it is not only a cold, cold forest. <laughs> and the best advertisement of the year award goes to the child pooping with some perfume. Chiang Mai, Chiang Mai has moved up in the world. There's a Calvin Klein here now and H&M. Uh, uh, yeah, that's your Like just the usual way. stuff. I'm surprised. I didn't used to be able to find any of that stuff at, in Chiang Mai. That was like a Bangkok only kind of thing. Oh, that guy.
Uh, that store was my dreams realized. This is my permanent face. I guess I'm gonna have to do a haul. And I'm in the supermarket. Apparently these are from Germany, but they look amazing. Oh my god! Please. Okay, here's the question. Do they have gluten-free stuff? And oh my god, yes they do. I am impressed. Highly impressed. Great job, Thailand. 10 thumbs up. I've actually tried those before. Mwah. Hated them. Hated them. They're very intense and minty and boah. But maybe you'll like them. <laughs> something really and fancy filled with coffee and blended up and my dad recommended a specific coffee place so we've come up to I don't know the third or fourth floor it's Jean's coffee so gotta have Jean's coffee Gloria Jean's Gloria Jean's coffee okay. eye candy everywhere <sighs> oh my goodness oh my goodness oh my goodness oh my goodness I was raving earlier about my favorite delicious sweet ice cream treat being affogaggio. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right or wrong, and they happen to have it. Oh, that's right. You were talking about that. You pour the coffee mm -hmm. over the ice cream. Mm -hmm. Espresso on vanilla ice cream. I'm laughing so hard and I'm all alone in this mall because I just saw a guy who works here walk up to that mannequin with a big metal cart with another guy. They stopped and started talking and as he was talking to the guy, he folded the fingers like that and just stroked the middle finger like a total creep. <laughs> For the longest time and no one noticed. The guy he was talking to had no idea. And then they walked away with the cart, and that's what was left, and it is hilarious to me. I cannot handle it. I wish I caught it on film. 